Hey evening everybody, this is Sunday City Full this, this is part 2 of Mega Man X4. That's how we left all we beat the intro balls, Aragon. And we're starting the game as, we're starting the game as Mega Man X. So now, I suggest you guys start by the spider first. Because, just like Mega Man X1 to 3, there's upgrade here as well. And this uh, upgrade here can be pretty easy to find. And when I mean upgrade, I mean them, um, got the light capsules. Well, Spider, he protects the secret weapon of the jungle. Hmm, what secret are you talking about? And this stage right here is pretty much fun. And like I said, Dynalite's capsule is in this stage. It can be tricky to find if, if this is your first time playing. But we're getting, we're getting close to it though. You have to go behind, you have to go behind the waterfall. Not that where the ball but the one below it. Which is right over here. See the little spot right there? There's our hover boots. This battle should have never happened, X. Why must we always fight each other? Why do these peacekeepers keep persisting and fighting each other? Why'd you call a mask on? This must be some sort of mistake. It is. This is all Sid was doing. Alright. Alright, alright, I'll, I'll tell him the rest. Oh, got the light. See, bores me. So anyway, so we got the hover boots where it allows us to, um, hover. But, I got a demonstrator for you guys, since X doesn't want to demonstrate for us. So, hit X twice, make him hover. And you can air dash, like you did in Mega Man X 2 and 3. But, unlike Mega Man X 3, he doesn't, uh, hover upwards. So keep that in mind. Trust me, this is why you want to start with a spider first, to get the hover boots. But I can tell you one thing, because later on in this game, you're going to fight this boss, which require, which, which require you to use a hover boot, because if you, if you try to fight him without the hover boots, you are severely fucked. I mean, trust me, you will get your ass kicked. Alright, trust me, it's my purpose. These guys can be annoying sometimes. I'm almost fucked up and die right there. Just be careful. And get this. Push the oh god! Oh god! Oh, that was close. Fucking control sticks fucking up on me. I thought I was off my balance. And this is something like uh, the Lion King for the Super Nintendo where we make a similar jump when he's fucking alive. So be sure you get the hurt boost first before, before further notice. And again, later on in this game, you will fight a boss that requires you to use the hurt boost because without it, you will get your ass kicked. Ah! Alright, come on, climb up. Do, 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 do. I, I absolutely enjoy this game. And by the way, after I get X5 done, I do X... Deliver! God damn it! After I finish with X4, I do X5, then it'll be X6. And I do own Mega Man X7 and 8. Well, kind of thing is, but I don't know if I'm going to do Mega Man X7 right away after I get Mega Man X6 done. I might start Mega Man 7 on the Anniversary Collection. We'll, we'll see, though. We'll see. Now we're in area number two. Yeah, this, this is something new to the Megman X series. Each uh, world has its uh, two segments. Alright, these fucking hops, no problem. Just keep tapping like crazy. I'm used to tapping the square button. But Metal Gear saw a different story in that torture room, in the microwave one, in Metal Gear Solid 4. Oh, there's just something I forgot to mention. And I thought I did, but today's date is June the 25th, 2011. And not only that, today it's been two years since Michael Jackson and Farrah Fawcett died. Can you believe it? It doesn't even feel like it was two years ago. Which means my secret minute LP is two years old. Because I remember when I record I remember when I recorded a uh, secret minute LP and I was so upset how Michael Jackson died. 
I even sound depressed about it. I think it's on part 20 of Secret Mana. It was the day he, it was when the day he died. Goddamn webs. Alright. Let's get that tank. You must, you must have the fucking boss already. Yup, we're there. Ah! Honk. So we got four extra lives. Then we can make it. Alright, here's our first boss of the game, technically. Man, this is why I, this is why I like Mega Man X 1 to 3 better because you don't hit that Warren son every time you face a boss. And there's Web Spider. Spider? You live with us all as Mavericks? I won't let you pass. Turn back now. Let's fight, Webby. Well, this boss fight can be pretty annoying, but watch out, he's he gonna shoot these fucking webs at you. And these webs hit you, you're like trapped. It will take like massive damage. I gotta say, I love this boss music playing in the background. I really do. Ah, oh, fuck! Yeah, I did not fucking jump on him. Alright, when Edge is about to die, he's gonna say, Time to get serious! You little bastard! You dare to trick me? You must die! Ah, fucking hell, man! I'm gonna die, man! Now I ain't got no E tank, because I ain't even find him yet. Hey, shit! Last fight. Alright, wait till we get the second phase, though. The second phase is bullshit. Missing that time, Web Spider. Fuckhead. Ha! Here we go. Here we go. That's all there is to it. Just keep on shooting dark that web shit. And try, and try not to get caught in it. Cause you basically fuck you do. But sometimes you get caught by that web, he'll he'll come from the ceiling and attack you, which takes more massive damage. Alright, he about to start his second phase pretty shortly. Yeah, just like Mega Man X2 and X3, each boss has his second phase. But Mega Man X1 was a disappointment. They didn't have no phase. But they still have weak points! Alright, here comes the second phase. And this part can be a bitch. But now you equip these fucking spider webs. And he's gonna throw these baby spiders at you. Like what that uh viral spider did on uh Magma X1 fuck! Uh-oh. I always fuck up and die here. Wait, wait, wait. God damn it! Oh god. Yeah, it's time to get serious. Oh shit, I'm not gonna make it. Yeah, that's what she said. Excuse me guys, I'm gonna meet you guys back in the second phase. Alright, let's start this again. Now I ain't even get hit, I ain't even get hit yet. So wish me luck on this one. Alright, here we go. Just watch me throw his fires at you. Like what the Fire Spider did on Mega Man X1 and Super Fortress. Now I'm gonna use Charge Shots! And I fucking missed. God forbid! Oh! Damn it! Just a few more hits. God damn it! Oh no, I'm not fucking dying! Oh, bull! Yes, we got him! Oh, that was close! I'm about to say, if I die one more time, I'm gonna have a fucking fix! But other than that, success! In that background, it looked like that fucking Nigma from Mega Man X5. Huh. You got the lightning web! And I could go to Split Mushroom next, but I'm gonna take out Frost Warris. Fire the spider net charged with electric 
electricity can be used to attack wall jump or double. Okay. So keep that in mind, folks. Alright. I'm gonna go to file number two and save it from there. Save successful. Return the game. Alright, next up, um, Brawl Force. Then after that, get into part two. Let's see who this fat motherfucker is. He protects the secret weapon which lies inside the snow. Uh, I can't, I don't know what the fuck it says because his, his big ass head is in the way. Oh my god! Do you see a familiar maverick in the background? In the ice capture? That's Blizzard Buffalo. From Mega Man X3. Remember? So I always, go, I always go up here for as a shortcut. Now you see what that um, spy weapon can do. Now just like that weapon hit the R1 button to change. Yup, like so. Alright, let's, go, all right, let's climb down here. That's to the left. I think the XL is over there. Yes. What did I tell you? Wait, wait for it, wait for it. Don't worry, it'll be spawn, it'll be spawn. I ain't got all day, thank you. Oh shit! Oh my god! That was too close for comfort. I've been making too many close calls lately. First of that log shit. I didn't dock. I stop. I didn't dock twice against web spider. And, my, and for some reason my arrow stick is like sticking. Oh god, come on. Alright, let's over here. Let's get that just for the fuck of it. What is a Mega Man game for the snow level? Alright, oh this is fucking shit. Yeah. Hey, don't stay on these platforms too long otherwise you won't get anywhere. So, in we go. We're about to fight a little mini boss. <gasps> oh my god! Who is that frozen out ice cube? That looks so like Chill Penguin. <gasps> it is Chill Penguin from Mega Man X1. He also makes an appearance. So now he's fighting the claw. The claw. The claw. I'm gonna get you the claw. Alright. Do, do, do. This music's kinda relaxing. Whoa! Now he's going to a different phase. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, watch him when he dash around the room like that. You don't want you don't want to take any hits. Damn! Now die motherfucker shit! Alright, now we're going to area number two. X was two snow base area two. Oh, there's a weapon tank here as well. It's sitting right it's sitting right in these one of these ice cubes that I'm shooting right now. Damn it. Oh look, and those fucking hammer oh, the helmet fuckers are back. They're recurring enemies. Shoot, my opinion, I think maybe that six is the hardest. But with me luck when I get to there. So I will be getting all the upgrades, all the hard tanks, and all the E-tanks. But I won't guarantee now 100% of Mega Man X6. Mega Man X6 is, is pretty much talking 100%. But I still gonna follow the capsules on there as well. And after I beat Mega Man X6, I don't know if I'm gonna do Mega Man X7 right away. But I will do Mega Man 7 eventually. Oh shit, watch out for that pickup because he fucking freezes the whole room. If you wait too long, but you can you can kill him before he freezes the whole room, just like that. But it's no big if he freezes the whole room. He's just gonna turn the enemies to He's gonna freeze the enemies, but when you shoot the enemies, they're gonna shoot all kinds of ice spikes at you. Sorry for the fast talking though. You almost have a fucking boss already. 
Oh, he can shoot the walls in this one, because on Mega Man X5, he doesn't shoot through walls. So, Capcom made it a little harder for us. On Mega Man X5, that is. Alright, go ahead and free the whole room. Yeah, see? It's no big, it just don't slip and fall. Yes. Alright, now it's time for our second boss. Uh, Frost Wars. And he's weak against uh, Mega Dragoon's weapon. Fucking joystick sucks, man. Keep on fucking sticking. Holy shit, that's big ass motherfucker. They sent a kid like you after me? I promise to end this quickly. We'll see about that, uh, Frost Wars. Now, watch his panners. Okay, when he claps once, he's gonna slide at you. But if he claps twice, he's gonna jump up the air and try to tackle you. So pay attention to his panners closely. Oh, he's gonna jump. Yup, what I tell you. And his second phase is kinda tricky. Alright, just keep on shooting this motherfucker like there's no tomorrow. Yes! Boom! You fair life, you fat fucking Morris. Yeah! Oh, not that hook, hook, hook shit. Cause now you're gonna shoot these fucking pussies in the ceiling. And try to hit you with it. <laughs> I love how you make that sound effect. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> oh shit. Don't you dare put your icy breath at me, fucker. Oh shit. You very covered up, Frost Warrior. Oh god. See, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, come on, I ain't fucking dying. Fuck, come on, don't die on me, don't die on me! Thank you! And now you are dead! <laughs> I just beat this motherfucker like mad, but please take your time if it's your first time playing. Don't rush yourself like I'm doing right now. Please don't rush yourself. Just take it easy and take your time. You'll you'll get it eventually. And the frost tower is, is useless. It just generates a huge ice that generates a huge ice block that acts as a shield. It can also be used to trap enemies before dissipating. So keep that in mind, folks. Alright. Come on, see what Number two, that is. Alright. So we got one upgrade, zero heart tanks, and one tank, the weapon tank, that is. So let's return the game. Alright, guys, this has been Something Able to sign out. See you guys next time on part uh, three of Mega Man X4. Something's 842, out.